Tuna are a, a very interesting fish in that they're, they're not completely cold-blooded but they're not completely warm-blooded. They just maintain their body temperature a little bit above the ambient water temperature and one of the reasons why they come here to the Great Australian Bight and forage off the Great Southern Reefs is not just the food but also the fact that the water is warm so they get an advantage by not having to retain heat within their body so they can digest quickly, forage a lot and put on that maximum amount of growth in a very short period of time. It was a high volume, low value fishery at that point in time. The stocks were clearly not able to support that sort of fishing pressure, particularly from an international level. Then there was a big science program developed to monitor sort of the stocks and work out what the actual levels of tuna were what the level of fishing pressure could be sustained by the stocks with a view to rebuilding the adult population to pre-fishing levels. After having a catch limit of 5,000 tonnes for many years, the stocks have now turned around, they're sustainable, having spent the last 30 years operating under a restricted fishing system to rebuild the global population of the southern bluefin tuna. We view it's Australia has an international duty of care to protect this ecosystem.